Stop overthinking your content. Before I tell you how, I'm going to tell you why. As beginner content creators, we should be focused on posting, not perfection. Because let's face it, when we're overthinking, we're trying to achieve some level of perfection. And that's not where our precious energy should be going towards. Hello, my name is Nala and I thought this would be a good time to pause the video and let you know what this season of my YouTube channel is about. Let's get into it. Welcome to Full-Time Mom to Full-Time Creator. This is season one of my channel, where I embark on the journey of mastering the delicate balance between motherhood and content creation. Join me as I share not only the highs and lows of this incredible balancing act, but also the valuable insights and learnings as a content creator starting from scratch. Together, we'll witness the remarkable transformation of my YouTube channel from its humble beginnings to reaching the milestone of a thousand subscribers. Get ready to be inspired, entertained, and motivated to pursue your own dreams as we embark together on this transformative adventure. Welcome to Full-Time Mom to Full-Time Creator. Now let's get back to the video. Just the other day, I found myself overthinking. I'm feeling, I'm feeling something, but I don't really know what it is. And I feel like it's rooted in overthinking when it comes to these videos. And I'm not sure what I'm feeling, but I'm feeling something. I was feeling a lack of confidence on my pursuit to becoming a full-time content creator. And confidence is the answer to stop overthinking your content. We've all been there questioning ourselves like, why does anyone want to come along with you on your day? And why is that even important to film? Like, why are you even doing this? Why am I... I mean, I'm questioning myself. But we have to move away from doubting ourselves and move into a more confident space. You literally have to be delusional, and I know you've probably heard that on the internet before, but it's true. You have to think that what you have to offer, even as a beginner, is worth creating. Notice I didn't say worth watching, because right now is about building the habit of creating content. In other words, confidence is the answer to stopping the overthinking cycle. We need to believe in ourselves even as beginners. It's not about seeking validation from others. It's about valuing what we have to offer and building the habit of consistently creating content. However, I have to admit there are moments where I struggle to maintain a positive mindset. In those moments, I do become my own worst critic and I doubt my ability to bring you along on my journey and capture the essence of what I'm doing. Recognizing these negative patterns of thinking is crucial. It reminds us that building confidence is an ongoing process and it's okay to have moments of self-doubt. The key is to acknowledge them and actively work towards maintaining a positive mindset. Sure, you guys probably didn't care to see me looking up oral hygiene TikToks or shopping for floss at Target, but those mundane moments of my life actually taught me a very valuable lesson in my own content creation journey. They reminded me that the key to creating engaging content is to stop overthinking and letting our authentic selves shine through. Overthinking often leads to self-doubt and analysis paralysis, but when we let go of that constant scrutiny, we unlock a whole new level of connection and creativity with our audience. So in conclusion, my fellow content creators, especially my beginner content creators, remember that overthinking can be a roadblock on our journey. It stifles our creativity, puts a damper on our enthusiasm, and it holds us back from sharing our voice with the world. And that's not what we wanna do. Let's silence the inner critic and focus on creating content that truly represents who we are. It's not about appeasing others or getting validation from others. It's simply about us caring enough about our own art and our own value that we can give to the world and doing our absolute best to make that happen day in and day out. I hope this video serves as a real life example of what it means to stop overthinking because like I said, I struggled with overthinking the other day and I, I still do. And I'm probably still gonna be doing that going forward, but it was very important for me to film this and get this out. It's not perfect. I just came from a full day of being a mom, a day where I had a headache most hours. My daughter, we had an appointment for her early on. I had to go to that. She got her shots today, so she had trouble going to sleep. I had to lay down with her 
until she actually fell asleep. I have on an old jersey, my old practice basketball jersey. My hair is whatever, but I'm filming this content because I want to get it out and I want to practice. So <sighs> thank you for watching and just remember that you can do it, we can do it. We're on this journey together. So I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.